Hi students, in this video, I am going to teach you about report writing. Report writing is the part of long writing skills and it comes for 10 marks in your paper and the word limit is 200 words. Students, report writing is further classified into two parts, newspaper report and magazine report. Newspaper report, as the name suggests, it comes in the newspaper and it gives us the knowledge about various incidents hap that happened around like like suppose it can be a, it can be an accident it can be any function that happened in the society it can be an inauguration ceremony basically that is to be informed to the masses and magazine report that is restricted to one particular organization or one particular school or one particular uh, society and that is catering to the people belonging to that institution, belonging to that organization and belonging to that society. So first, students, I'm going to teach you about newspaper report. Newspaper report, as the format of the newspaper report is, first, you have to give the title. The title should not be very long. It should be catchy. And then you have to talk about the name of the person who's reporting, correspondent, like his designation and this is TOI. TOI means Times of India. So you can talk about the newspaper name here, the designation and the name of the newspaper. Then students along with the margin line, it has to start exactly from the starting, not from in beginning. You have to give the name of the city where that accident happened or that incident happened, date when it happened. Now students, it is further classified into three paragraphs. Be very particular about making paragraph. It should not be in a complete uh, one long uh, paragraph because that can confuse the, uh, the checker. So these questions to be answered. Majority, your the report, the description should be based on these questions. What happened? Where did it happen? How did it happen? When did it happen? And how many people they were involved in that. And then you have to add lots of details. Students are emphasizing on adding lots of details. These details will not be given in the, the statement. You have to add it on your own. Describe in an elaborated manner. Like you are talking, you are reporting an accident. Then you have to talk about uh, how did it actually happen? The bus collided with the uh, the bus collided with the car, and how many people got injured? How many uh, how many of them? Uh, how who all were standing at the who all were the onlookers and uh, who all were taken to the hospital? What was the action taken? So basically, you have to add as per the statement. Okay. Like now, let's students. I will give you an example of newspaper reports. Like focus here, last week you attended a heritage awareness program organized by History Club of Modern Public School Agra. Being a staff reporter, write a report to be published in National Daily. You are Akash Akanksha. Now students see, see the heading, heritage awareness program. That is straightforward by the name of the, the, name of the staff reporter and his designation. New Daily, the month and the date. Heritage, uh, Heritage Awareness Program was organized by History Club of Modern Public School, Agra, on 9 September from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. in the school premises. Dear students, it is only one line, but it carries lots of information. It has given you about when, date, where, and what was the time. The school, well decorated with posters of various historically important monuments, like who was the chief guest, then the details of the event is given there, like how many students participated, what all happened there. So this is all information that is uh, added there. Okay, now this is about celebration of cleanliness week. This is about, now this is an accident. This I really wanted to focus on this report. Here, see, train accident, 7 dead, 16 injured. Very catchy and very straightforward heading. Ghaziabad, January, 7 school children were killed and 16 injured when the Taj Express rammed into a school bus at a manned railway crossing near Pulva station. 
15 kilometers from here so first line very clearly precising about the event the date the time and the manner and then the accident occurred the time is given now the reason of the accident the crossing had been closed but was opened by railway gate man on the request from the bus driver who was in hurry to get the students to school neither of them saw the train so this is all detail is added okay now after that the the consequence what is announced by the railway and uh, what is given to the relatives so the conclusion part is also there so this is how students you have to add the details you have to add how many people injured what happened uh, how, who all were onlookers and then what was the action taken the action taken by the authorities the action taken by the people so this is how the newspaper report it goes now comes to the second category of report writing that is magazine report writing dear students this report writing you must have read so many times even in your school magazine like any accident any sorry any function that happens any assembly that happens we report it okay you are quite familiar with this kind of report writing now this report writing its format it has title and it has only the name it does not have the designation now students again it is divided into three paragraphs now the three paragraphs the first paragraph will contain type of event and occasion okay like suppose if it is call a bed ceremony then you will announce that uh, the uh, every year the school organizes prize distribution function that is that is named as scholar bed ceremony and this year also the scholar bed ceremony was organized for the students of classes 9th and 10th in dhwani auditorium so this is how you have introduced your uh, you have introduced your uh, event after that date time and venue and who is the chief guest this is very important every event must have a chief guest and the performances because you know in school functions students they perform they perform dance they perform skit as per the uh, as per the event then after that after the function finishes then you have to talk about what is people's opinion how the spectators responded like they applauded the they applauded so loud they appreciated the effort and then you have you know you know every function has a chief guest speech at the end the chief guest always appreciate the staff always appreciate the students and always gives a lesson in his speech so you have to quote the words i will emphasize on quoting the words of the chief guest you can talk that while addressing the audience the chief guest uh, motivated the students and applauded the teachers behind the success of this event and then conclusion overall it was a resounding success overall it etched in the hearts and minds of the people so this is how you will uh, you will uh, give the uh, this is how you will conclude the event okay let's uh, now let's show you the example of this report writing like see students this is a report of a school event gd goenka school celebrated the independence day with great enthusiasm and patriotic fervor on morning this is the date given our students presented see this is the date given this is the date given our students presented hand made greeting cards and in tricolor flag badges to the senior management functionaries of the school the cultural program at school commenced with everyone singing vande mataram so this is the performance happened now mr indu bala sharma the district magistrate students it is very important to give the name as well as the designation of the chief guest and after that how the function is actually taking place the spirit of freedom and the nationalism was felt well exhibited by the students as well as the teachers through a spectrum of patriotic poems speeches quiz on freedom fighter songs and dance so uh, this is how the celebration of independence day is celebrated a documentary on the contribution of unsung heroes of indian freedom that is shown so all thing that happened and then the principal it ended with a speech by the principal on the topic what does freedom mean to me the celebration concluded with the inspiring words of principal madam followed by the national anthem and the distribution of refreshments see students it has a sequence from starting the hosting of the national flag from the principal speech and the distribution of refreshments this is how the link of ideas should be 
very clear. The cohesion of the lines should be very clear. It should not be a haphazard sequence of events. It should not be haphazardly presented. So, dear students, I hope you must be clear with report writing. I will be sending you some statements. Uh, I will be sending you some reports to be solved. Please solve it and submit it by tomorrow.